For our 25th wedding anniversary, Sue and I were living here in Panama, so we took a cruise in the Caribbean. I'd never been out on the ocean before, and I was amazed by how little movement you feel when you're in a large ship. I think we had pretty calm seas, so I'm sure there are exceptions. But one day when we could feel some stem to stern movement, we happened to walk through the deck housing the indoor pool. What we saw there was amazing. The rough condition of the ocean was directly reflected in the waters of the pool. There were white caps in the pool. Actually, very little of the pool was in the pool. They had it securely roped off since you would have been smashed to pieces swimming in those tumultuous waters. Here's another strange thing. Suddenly, the movement of the ship was alarmingly noticeable. But then when we got out of sight of that pool, the ride seemed to calm down and become more enjoyable. Often in life, I get my eyes fixed on my little pool. Everything happening around me stirs the tempest more. But the tempest in my little piece of water is not the only reflection of reality. I can fixate on my little pool in terror or retreat to the perspective of a reality that is much larger and more stable. The tempest in my life is real, but my life is in the mighty hands of my Creator. Isaiah says, you keep him in perfect peace whose mind is stayed on you because he trusts in you. Trust in the Lord forever, for the Lord God is an everlasting rock.